This is day four at Grand Teton National Park. And today I went to Oxbow Bend for the sunrise. The mountain modern reflection on this Snake River was absolutely breathtaking. And in addition to that, there was like uh, this fall foliage out of this world. It was really beautiful, like, you know, um, at the dawn and then once the sun came out and then hit those, like, you know, fall foliage, uh, it, it looked very amazing. I didn't expect that um, at the Oxbow Bend there will be so many people. I found so many people like just lined up to take that picture of the sunrise. It was unbelievable. Super cold. But the sights were breathtaking. I mean, the reason I came to Grand Teton was um, I saw a picture by Jonathan Iris. He's a he and I think his, uh, his uh, wife actually traveled all across the U.S. visiting all the national park and they are also featured in Nat Geo. So I saw the picture of Oxbow Bund at the sunrise during fall colors. That is when I decided I'm going to go check it out. And the view was exactly the way I imagined when I saw his picture. So I'm really happy that Finally, I accomplished coming back here and check out that awesome spot. So that's the power of a picture. It can move you, it can help you take a decision which you might never even thought about. And in the end, I'm really happy that I was able to come here and then take that picture exactly similar to what Jonathan Iris did. So thank you, Jonathan. Uh, I know you may not see this video ever, but I just wanted to convey that.
the when I arrived, it was so cold, cloudy, raining, and everything. Within a couple of days, everything got normal. Now it's beautiful, sunny, and you can see this amazing mountain range. So from here, I'm going to the summit mountain, and I'm going to find a turnout for this summit. I'm going to check it out today, and then afterwards, I'm planning to take one shot of Grand Teton and a road which meets. I saw that in uh, Instagram, so I want to try it out. Uh, I know the location. I'm going to check it out if the location is correct. And from there, that's my evening shot for today. And uh, let's see how it comes out. But overall, this is my last day at Grand Teton. It's absolutely a wonderful experience going through all the trails and watching like beautiful landscapes, Jenny Lake, Taggart Lake, so many other lakes. I think Teton is up there <laughs> somewhere. I haven't seen the Yellowstone yet, but let's see how that turns out.